So, you help run this place? Maybe you can give me the code to that door. The code to the office? I just thought you might have the number. I do, but I couldn't possibly give you access before the police arrive. I figured I wasn't going to get the door code from Lane by playing nice. I needed to turn the heat up. Let's turn up the heat by clipping his eyelids off with a nail clipper. Are these your nail clippers, Mr. Lane? Yes, they have my initials monogrammed on them. Huh. The perfect implement for cutting the alarm on a stone painting. What are you saying? Well, the alarm was sabotaged, Mr. Lane. It was an inside job. Are you accusing me? How dare you? I had no reason to kill Henri. No motive whatsoever. Okay, but I don't think the cops will see it like that. And I sure would like that door code. How about it, Mr. Lane? Ready to give me the door code yet? Certainly not. Give me a single reason why I should. Guilty by way of nail clippers. I've been away from Paris for several days and only got back this morning. How could I have cut that wire? This is an inside job for hmm. sure, Mr. Lane. The police are going to be very interested in your recent movements. I've been out of town for several days, and last night I retired early. Just saying. You're not going to scare me into giving you that door code, you know. I was onto something here, and I knew it. Lane was sweating. It wasn't pretty. I still think we should threaten him by way of nail clipper and removing his eyelids. The cable for the camera ran into the room. Perhaps we can use the hands as a Didn't we question him about everything already? Eh. Oh well. I do like the hint system. How about it, Mr. Lane? Just to Ready to give me the door anything. code yet? Certainly not. Guilty by I've been away from Pap. Mr. Lane, this robbery is not going to reflect well on you. As I said, I shall take my chances. You're not getting that door code. So, you'd been out of town and hit the sack early last night? That's right. I've not been near the gallery for days. I hate to say this, Mr. Lane, but you're going to be the number one suspect for this murder. So you keep saying, Mr. Stobart. How about some more of this? I don't think so. As a cell volatile, it was acceptable. As a cologne, it would be barbaric. Guilty by way of nail clippers. Sheer fantasy. What possible motivation could I have to sabotage the alarm? Can we maybe, maybe father knows something? Father? Yes, my son. What did you mean when you said that a great evil had taken place? Your adversary, the devil, as a roaring lion, walketh about seeking whom he may devour. What? Peter 5.8. The devil is all around, Mr. Stobart. Yes, the devil's all around. He's everywhere. He whispers evil things in your ear. He's in the pizza box on the floor. He's everywhere. What brought you to the exhibition, Father? The painting. Which one? La Maledictio, of course. The painting that was stolen. I had to confront the evil. I think there's something strange going on here. Yes, Mr. Stobart. At last you see the truth. No, Father. I mean that the robbery looks like an inside job. The devil's work is always an inside job. You know, I'm going to assume the game's universe that it is going to turn out to be the devil or something, but normally this would sound a bit odd. 
Because everything, everything, eh, the devil did it. My trip, my shoelaces are untied. The devil did it. Toast lands butter side down. The devil did it. A wire in the painting's alarm was deliberately cut. Cut by the devil himself, perhaps. <laughs> well, as far as I know, sightings of guys with horns and tails have been a little down recently. You mock me, <laughs> Mr. Stobart. But as you will discover, the, text. the devil likes to have the last laugh. Cut by the devil himself. Of course. Of course, the devil. The devil and his amazing wire cutting ability. <laughs> Okay, okay, I'm good. I'm good. Do you know the code to get into the office? No. But you could always pray and ask for divine guidance. With respect, Father, I'm looking for a slightly quicker solution. Did Henri say anything before he died? He said, Stop the car. I want to get in. Um, what does that mean? We may never know. What do you know about the man who painted La Maledictio? El Serp. He was a man playing with fire. The fire of eternal damnation. Tell me about the stolen painting. Whoever gets close to it will burn in hell. Wait, you got everyone in this room, what do you mean close to it, like, is there an approximation, like, within ten feet you go to hell? If that's the case, everyone in this room, including the robber, you, me, the fat guy, and the dead guy, are all going to hell for standing in the close proximity of the painting. And hell, that one guy that has the painting, he's going to the special hell, because he's holding it. Special do you hell. recognize these? Nail clippers. I'm not sure what your point is. Hey, Father. How about a squirt? I think not. No one had... I decided to leave it alone. The alarm... So, what... The bus was balanced... I didn't want to knock it off. Hmm. See if we can't. How about it, Mr. Lane? Certainly. Certainly Guilty. not. I've been. Nothing new we can do there. Let's see, let's see our hint system. Why not? Maybe there's something on Andre's body. I didn't need to look at the notice. Poor guy. I still get. The, the, I can't even. I can't even hear the dialogue because I've got everything turned down. But it can't be as ridiculous the label as it's said it was written down. Just ninety thousand for this one. I still needed to. I needed a better That was all Maybe we can That wasn't There wasn't anything loose to snip The clipper I still need Enough. All the alarms work right at this present moment. Can we use the clippers on maybe something in this general vicinity? Nope. I don't know. It says put pressure. If I go to hint thing, it says put pressure on him. But we did. Now let's maybe we should go out real quick.
The poster looked... As they say, Spanish. Maybe we can go out and find something of use. I wondered if there was anything out here I could use. Maybe we, no, we don't want the achievements. Yeah, we need to put the heat on him, but... But how? You gotta hand it to the French. For a moment, I can't... But a man was dead? Wait, I'm an insure... I, I insure artwork. So my job isn't to... You know, just kind of... Spitballing things, but, uh... It looked from out here. You couldn't see the stolen. I've always been a sucker for. Well, we looked. Maybe that'll put heat on. I don't know. How about it? Guilty. Guilty by way of blah, 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 blah. So, that. Mr. I. I wondered if there was anything out. The aid, the tried and true method of. I have all clicking everywhere. Excuse me. Monsieur. There's just been a robbery at the gallery. Oh, man. You don't sound surprised. All property is theft, monsieur, and all art is property. Therefore, all art is theft. Do you not agree? What? Uh, well, uh, when you put it like that, it's <clears throat> hard not to. Did you see anybody run out of the gallery earlier? There was a beautiful woman with a camera. She was chasing somebody. Well, that must have been Nico. You know her? You surprise me. Can you tell me anything about the man she was chasing? I assume, monsieur, that like all of us, he is inherently unknowable. No wonder this guy's cafe was empty. What is this, some... Uh, what is this guy? And what was that? You're surprised that I know her? I'm making direct inquiries about the robbery. About a thief. And you're surprised that I know the person who was chasing the thief while standing here asking you about the thief. The gallery owner, Henri, was shot dead trying to stop the robbery. Life has no meaning the moment you lose the illusion of being eternal. Right. Did you know him well? Can we ever truly know another human being, monsieur? He spent little time at the cafe, unlike his friend, monsieur Lane. What do you know about Hector Lane? Lane? Oh, yes. He drinks here sometimes. He slid away last night without paying. Last night? What sort of time? After midnight, for sure. If you see him, give him this bill and tell him to pay up next time. The check was from last night. But Lane told me he was nowhere near the gallery. This could be the leverage I needed to get the office door code from Lane. Wait, I thought check was spelled C-H-E-C-K. Thank you for your Not consistent Maybe it's, I don't know. What do I know? Let's go interrogate the fat man before I have to listen to that guy one more time and blow my brains out. You, 
Guilty. By way of drink. Take a look at this. Walt Harbors. It's your bill from the cafe next door. So? It's dated yesterday. Last night, in fact. 12.30 to be exact. You said you were out of town. You sure drank a lot of champagne last night without paying the bill. But you told me that you were away from Paris last night. I hate to say it, but that sounds like a lie to me. Tell you what, you give me the code of the door and the police need never know. A motive and proof of involvement. Not looking good, Mr. Lane. You are a blackmailer, Stobart. Just doing my job. All right. You have me. The number is 6397. But I admit to none of these spurious accusations. I had the code. The police would be here any moment, so I had to work fast. I don't think the police will be here anytime soon, to be completely honest. What was that number again? Six four. How are you forgetting? We just right We just literally went over it. I am Inspector Navet of the Paris Serious Crime Squad, and I hereby declare this crime scene open. I mean closed. Now, nobody move. Especially you on the floor. Mo, I want a total lockdown. Nobody in or out. Apart from me, of course. It looks like Randall from uh, from freaking Recess growing up. <laughs> 